My father was an ex-Navy man. And uh, quite often, uh, we would drive by the CNE and I would see the ship as a young lad taking my mom to work. And uh, he caught me watching one day out of the car and said, would you like to go see HMCS Haida? And I'd say, yeah, sure would. And that's how it started. That's how my love for the ship came through. Years later, Oakville's Walt Dermott joined the friends of HMCS Haida when she was still at Ontario Place. Uh, eventually uh, worked my way up to the board of directors and uh, we've been very active uh, with the friends and our partners Parks Canada in keeping the history alive here. Uh, creating a mascot uh, based on a rabbit, which was a rabbit from the ship back during the Second World War that we call Petty Officer Crusher, uh, right down through to uh, giving tours and uh, putting up displays in our gift shop and museum on the shore. The original onshore museum was created by college students, but wasn't much more than framed two by fours. So we raised a, a large chunk of money and we rebuilt the whole inside of the museum, added insulation, added flooring, uh, added a drop ceiling, uh, just so we could protect all of the uh, museum artifacts and house our gift shop. Recently, he received provincial recognition for all the work he's done. I received a, a phone call, I guess, uh, early April from the Lieutenant Governor General's office. Uh, and the uh, member there advised me that uh, I would be a recipient for the 2020 Ontario Medal for Good Citizenship. And I was shocked and I sort of thought, oh, maybe this is a bit of a hoax phone call, you know, maybe, maybe one of my friends put somebody up to this. But uh, not so. I was really quite, uh, quite honored and, and quite pleased. And it was for the work uh, done here for HMCS Haida through the friends of HMCS Haida. All right. Coming up from the officer's war room. Walt has also worked as a naval reservist for more than 22 years. In addition to helping preserve naval history, he's working to secure its future. Uh, at this particular point in my career, I work with cadets. I work with youth. And uh, it's great to teach them leadership techniques. It's great to watch them build and grow. It's great to see them stand up and become more confident. And it's great to see them start to evolve into strong Canadian citizens. And if we don't take care of our youth and give them lots of experience, uh, it'll make things a little bit shaky for our future. So this provides a real solid foundation for the youth. And that's just the ship. She's old, she's creaking. Congratulations on your well-deserved recognition, Walt. Reporting for Halton News, I'm Nikki Wesley.